Good morning, Cedar River Elementary School. Today is Wednesday. It is May 10th, and here are your daily announcements. First of all, we continue our ESPA testing this week. So gentle reminders about walking quietly in the hallway for our third, fourth, and fifth graders who are showing what they know. And they've done a wonderful job persevering and working really hard for our testing this week. Uh, let's see here. We have some exciting events coming up. I do want to also say thank you to our student council who provided uh, our breakfast for our leaders, feeding leaders last Friday. It was wonderful out in the courtyard. Thank you to our student leaders who are working hard to make a difference here at Cedar River and in our community. We have our, let's see here, Honor Spring Choir on May 11th. And our, I, I know I went to the first grade concert last week. Mrs. Bauer is doing a wonderful job with all of our students here. They sing and participate in our music festivities. Can't wait to see that one. Uh, let's see, what else do we have going on here? We have our play. Um, our play practice continues. We have that assembly on May 15th. We have our third, fourth, and fifth graders will view our play from 9.45 to 10.45, and our TK through second grade will view it from 2 o'clock to 3 o'clock. This week, we also celebrate teacher, teacher Appreciation Week for all of our teachers in the building and everything they do to support students in our community and our school. They work really, really hard. And it's also Nurses Appreciation Day. It's been a really busy Appreciation Week, and our wonderful nurse, Chelsea uh, helps all of our students and our staff and our families here at Cedar River every day to make sure they're well, they feel good, they might have to get some clean pants from our muddy field. So for all the things we think our teachers and our nurse and one more, we also on Friday, it's National Child Care Provider Day. Our EEP staff does a wonderful job supporting our students before and after school. They're the first ones here last ones to leave, and I know Mrs. Scratch and all of our paraeducators that support EEP do a wonderful job. So if you go to EEP, make sure to give a high five to our EEP staff. We actually have the best EEP staff in all of the schools here in the district. That is all I have for you today. We're going to end our morning announcements with some happenings around the school from Mrs. Landry's class. As always, it's a great day to be an otter. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you here on Monday.